In the heart of North Korea, where the oppressive regime maintains an iron grip on its citizens, one man dreams of freedom. The year is 2024, and new security measures have made escape more perilous than ever. Surveillance is omnipresent. Drones patrol the skies, border guards are equipped with the latest technology, and an informant network so vast that trust is a luxury few can afford. Our story begins with a young man named Min Jun, who is determined to break free from the chains of oppression. Min Jun knows the risks. He understands that failure means death or a lifetime in a labor camp, yet the call of freedom is too strong. He begins his escape plan by researching all possible routes. The first option is the heavily fortified demilitarized zone, DMZ, separating North and South Korea. The DMZ is one of the most dangerous borders in the world, filled with landmines, barbed wire and heavily armed soldiers. Min Jun quickly realizes that crossing the DMZ is almost certain death. Next, Min Jun considers the sea. North Korea's coastline is tightly controlled with naval patrols and heavy surveillance. The idea of building a raft or finding a boat seems promising. He envisions himself setting out to sea under the cover of darkness, evading patrol boats and radar systems. However, the odds of being detected and captured are too high. Many have tried and failed their fates, serving as grim reminders of the sea's dangers. This route is also eliminated. Pause 2S. Min Jun and Hyojin have crossed into Siberia, but the true test of their endurance is only beginning. The Siberian wilderness is a stark, unforgiving expanse, stretching endlessly in every direction. The cold is merciless, biting through the makeshift layers of clothing. Each step is a struggle against the elements, but they press on, driven by the hope of reaching freedom. Pause 2S. They move cautiously avoiding any signs of civilization to evade detection. Their survival skills are put to the test as they forage for food and drink from streams. The nights are the hardest, the temperature plummeting to unbearable lows. They huddle together for warmth, sharing stories of their past and dreams for the future. These moments of connection keep their spirits alive, a flicker of light in the oppressive darkness. Pause to S. Days turn into weeks and weeks into months. The journey is grueling, but Min Jun and Hye Jin refuse to give up. They encounter wild animals, treacherous terrain, and the constant threat of hypothermia. Yet they find strength in each other, their bond growing stronger with each passing day. Pause to S. One particularly harsh night, they come across an abandoned cabin. It's a rare stroke of luck providing shelter from the biting wind. Inside, they find remnants of past inhabitants, a broken stove, tattered blankets, and a few canned goods. It's not much, but it feels like a treasure trove. They light a small fire, the warmth a welcome relief from the relentless cold. Pause to S. As they sit by the fire, Min Jun and Hye Jin reflect on their journey. They have come so far, but they know the hardest part is yet to come. The Russian authorities are known to patrol the border regions and one wrong move could lead to capture. They must stay vigilant, their senses sharpened by the constant danger. Pause 2S. With renewed determination, they prepare to continue their journey. The path ahead is uncertain, but they have each other and the hope of a new life beyond the wilderness. Min Jun and Hye Jin step out of the cabin, leaving behind the relative safety of its walls. The Siberian wilderness awaits a daunting challenge that they face together. Pause 2S. Their journey is far from over, but they are no longer alone. In the vast frozen expanse of Siberia, they find strength in their shared struggle. The road to freedom is long and perilous, but Min Jun and Hye Jin are ready to face whatever comes their way. Together, they move forward, one step at a time, towards the promise of a brighter future. Pause 3S. The journey through Siberia continues, a testament to their resilience and unwavering hope. Min Jun and Hai Jin are determined to reach the other side where freedom awaits. The path is treacherous, but their resolve is unbreakable. They will overcome every obstacle 
driven by the dream of a life without fear. Pause 3S to be continued. Pause 2S. One night, Minjun and Hyejin stumble upon a group of travelers in the vast frozen expanse of Siberia. These travelers, though wary at first, offer them food and shelter. Minjun and Hyejin are hesitant, their trust worn thin by the harsh journey. But the warmth and kindness of the travelers eventually win them over. They share stories by the fire, learning that the travelers are heading towards a larger town where they might find someone willing to help them get to a safer place. Grateful for the company and support, Minjun and Hyejin decide to join the group. As they approach the town, Minjun and Hyejin know that this is their final test. They must find someone they can trust to help them continue their journey. The group parts ways and Minjun and Hyejin blend in with the crowds, their hearts pounding with a mix of fear and hope. They ask discreet questions, looking for someone who can assist them without arousing suspicion. Days turn into a nerve-wracking search, but finally they find a contact. It's a risky move, but they have no other choice. The contact agrees to help them, and together they plan the final leg of their journey. The plan is to get them to a safe house and eventually connect them with an organization that helps North Korean defectors. The day comes, and Minjun and Hyejin follow the instructions carefully, avoiding detection. They move swiftly, their hearts racing with anticipation. The journey is treacherous, but they finally reach the safe house. There, they meet others who have escaped, each with their own story of courage and survival. Minjun and Hyejin's journey is far from over, but they have made it this far. They know that with determination, courage, and a bit of luck, they can achieve their dream of freedom. Their story is a testament to the indomitable human spirit and the enduring hope for a better life. As they look towards the future, Minjun and Hyejin know that their struggle has just begun, but they are ready to face whatever challenges lie ahead. But wait, what if Minjun and Hyejin didn't take the northern route? Let's rewind and explore another potential escape path through China. Once again, Minjun starts his journey under the cover of night, moving cautiously towards the Tuman River. This route is infamous for its dangers, heavily monitored with frequent patrols. Minjun has heard stories of others who have tried and failed. He knows this is a high-risk path, but the thought of freedom pushes him forward. He makes it to the riverbank and waits for the right moment. The night is cold and the river is freezing. Minjun takes a deep breath and starts crossing the icy waters. Halfway across, he hears voices and the distant sound of dogs barking. His heart races. He quickens his pace, but the ice beneath him cracks. He slips and falls into the freezing water. Panic sets in as he struggles to pull himself out. The barking grows louder, and he knows he's been spotted. Exhausted and freezing, Minjun realizes this path has led to failure. Let's try again. This time, Minjun considers bribing officials. He gathers what little money and valuables he can find, hoping to buy his way out. He finds a contact in his village who claims to have connections. Minjun arranges a meeting, his heart heavy with anxiety and hope. The night of the exchange, he waits in a dimly lit alley. A man approaches, but something feels off. Before Minjun can react, he's surrounded by guards. The contact was a trap. He's arrested and taken away, his dreams of escape shattered once more. Let's try another option. Minjun decides to attempt the sea route. He finds an old fisherman willing to help him in exchange for labor and what little he can offer. They plan to set sail under the cover of darkness. The night of the escape, the sea is rough and the boat is small. Minjun helps load supplies and they push off into the night. The waves crash against the boat and the cold sea spray stings his face. Hours pass and they've made some distance when suddenly a spotlight blinds them. A naval patrol boat has spotted them. The fisherman tries to evade, but it's too late. They're ordered to stop. Minjun knows they're caught. This route has also failed. Let's explore another. The safe house is quiet, save for the occasional murmur of voices planning the next steps. Minjun and Haijin sit in a dimly lit room, their minds racing with the gravity of what lies ahead. They have come so far, yet the final leg of their journey is the most perilous. 
The plan is to cross the border into a neighboring country where they will be met by an international organization that assists defectors. The risk is immense, but it's their best chance at freedom. The night before the crossing, Minjun and Hyojin barely sleep. They review the plan over and over, knowing that any mistake could cost them everything. As dawn breaks, they set out with a small group. The air is frigid and the tension is palpable. Minjun's heart pounds as they approach the border. The group moves silently, sticking to the shadows, every sound amplified in the stillness of the early morning. Suddenly they hear footsteps and the crackle of a radio. Guards are patrolling nearby. Minjun signals for everyone to stop. They crouch low, every breath held as the guards pass just meters away. The group remains undetected and Minjun's heart slowly resumes its rhythm. They reach the border fence and Minjun takes out the wire cutters. His hands tremble with cold and fear, but he works quickly. The fence gives way and one by one, they slip through the opening. On the other side, they are greeted by members of the international organization who quickly usher them into waiting vehicles. As they drive away, Min Jun and Hie Jin finally allow themselves to breathe. The journey has been long and fraught with danger, but they have made it. Tears of relief and joy stream down their faces as they realize the magnitude of what they have achieved. They are taken to a safe location where they are given new identities and the means to start a new life. The road ahead will still be challenging, but they are free. Min Jun and Hai Jin's story is one of incredible courage and resilience, a testament to the human spirit's unyielding desire for freedom. Thank you for watching this extended dramatic tale of escape and survival. If you found this video compelling, please like, share and subscribe to our channel for more stories of courage and resilience. Stay tuned for more incredible tales of human endurance and the fight for freedom.